Hello my fellow subscribers and MemSN users out there. Today I'll be showing you Messenger Plus 5. This is a review of the new program. Now it is compatible with uh, Windows Live Messenger 2011. New preferences and options, My Plus, online logging, and the same features which were in the previous ones, which is Skin Messenger, Feel, Share, Laugh, and a bunch of add-ons. You can do scripts, so you can do like infinite nudges and whatnot that you can't do without Messenger Plus. It is virus free and it's for Windows 7 and Windows Vesta, but this is for Windows 7 for you know special features. So um just download it and install it. It will the link will be in, in the description. So um um when you first install it and you log in, in your Windows Live Messenger, you should get a window like this for configuration. Just go ahead and click on next. It should show the Messenger Plus icon on the window. It, as it shows here, next, you can just uh let it nof notify you but not for me. Click on next. This one pops up, and you can just click on yes if you want to disable that. And you can have a My Plus account, which you can sign up at the website of Messenger Plus. But uh, I'm not going to do that right now. I'm just going to click on next and next. Click on next. It can show you all everything with the new interface, preferences, and options, which has been improved with a layout revised. It lets you choose more customizable skins because of the new eye candy on Windows Live Messenger 2011. You know, a lot of complainers out there about the new WLM 2011. It's actually really good because there's more uh, uh, Explorer files to edit into it. Appearance and skins. Click on next. You can do advanced logs if you're into codes and chat log viewer, which is professional instead of a text file like on the old uh, Windows Live Messengers. So click on next. You can show everything here. Next. Next. So desktop contact. Um, Windows to stop to a closer look on your most important friends. Well, I'll be showing everything and let's get started. So, Windows Live Messenger to 2011, the new features. If you click on this, display event viewer, chat log viewer, sound library, you know, you get to choose your own custom sounds and add in a new sound, or you can get it from the official website and visit the online database if you click on the drop down box and yeah you can go into the website and find custom sounds let's say like uh, video games and whatnot so mainly almost everything is free on this uh, maybe there's some amount of budget in order to buy some certain things preferences and options messenger skins you can get new skins and uh, change the look of messenger and it will load the website of where to change your skins it's really really uh, fantastic because you can it's more customizable than previous Windows Live Messengers so I'm gonna go through and choose a customized one oh look at that they got Playboy yikes <laughs> uh, let's search Xbox oh, nothing for Xbox well I'm just gonna go with something simple well I couldn't really find much of uh, the theme supported for Windows Live Messenger 2011 so maybe in the future they will be supporting so I'm going to be choosing a PlayStation theme. I like PlayStation and Xbox, just to remind you guys. This is how it will look. So um, to download it, I'm going to click on that. And here it comes. I'm just going to click on download. And choose a directory to save it on your computer. I'm going to make a folder in my documents when Windows Live Messenger themes. Now as you get that done, you should get a file like this saved. So open a Windows Live Messenger. Let me go back to Compact View and click on there change the look of messenger and all we have to do is just open up the file and this will pop up enable the skin after import and click on import it shall restart Windows Live Messenger obviously and it will restart back up as we wait for it then log back in just to remind everybody this is a new way for uh, Windows Live Messenger 2011 so there will be updates and newer users to create some skins so this one isn't as great it's kinda difficult and they make it a bit funky it's better if it's official things that do it because look at that it's really kinda ugly you can choose here no effect on the login screen you can choose whatever here um, it's customizable that's the thing so this is uh, Windows Live Messenger with Messenger Plus 5 from the website. You can check it out yourself. I showed a little bit of the new features on it. Mainly it supports the newest one, uh, just a new look. And that's basically it. There's new preferences and options, which I forgot to mention. Um, I'm about to. Let me just 
figure this out because they really uh, made it funky. I'll be back. As soon as I logged in, I will be showing you the new interface, just a new interface, and they organize it more carefully. Um, if you go into plus and preferences and options, and there you go. They just enhanced it. You can search in preferences with a search engine input it. They give they gave it some transitions between everything you hover on sounds and more advanced options for advanced users messenger plus can do so much more as you notice um, you can customize your own status if you click over here and more statuses personalized status you can customize your own I will not be presenting it I'm making this a quick video so you can check it out yourself you can change your theme of course this is all natural in the Windows Live Messenger company you can get scripts. Um, I will show a video about scripts and maybe give you some tips about it. It's pretty cool. Um, what you can do with Windows Live Messenger Plus. So it's exciting. I recommend for you to get it. It does not cause any interruptions and corrupted files on your computer. Perfectly fine. Goodbye.